Okay, so let us see whose turn is this. I have uh, fed right now some uh, students that were on my uh, tips. Okay, let's see whose turn is this. So it's Jatin's turn, right? So Jatin. Jatin, you will answer the question. Jatin, raise your hand and you will answer the question now. It's your turn. Jatin, where are you? He's not here right now. Okay. Let's see whose turn is this next. First of all, the students are entering. Okay, so this is Prachi's turn now. Okay, Prachi's turn. Yes, Prachi, raise your hand. You have to tell me what is the SI unit of power, Prachi. You have to tell me what yes, is the SI unit of power. Ma'am, what? Okay, and define it also. Define also. Define one define. watt or tell me the value of one watt. Tell me the value of one watt. Uh, yes. Let's see whose turn is this next. Yes, this is Unyasa's turn. Unyasa, yes. Unyasa, where are you? Whosoever gets the turn will raise hand so that I can unmute that person. But Unyasa's uh, audio is not connected right now. So uh, she must not be aware of what's going on in the class. There is no use of being there in the class. Unyasa, turn on your audio. Somebody text her that she must turn on the audio. Okay, then uh, whose turn is this next? Let's see. Divya, yes. So this is Divya's turn now. Okay, yes, Divya. What is one watt equal to? One watt is equal to one kilowatt. One? Kilowatt. Watt is equal to kilowatt? No, beta, no. Okay, Jia, ab batao. Ma'am, one joule per second. Joule per second. One watt is one joule per second. Okay, so the passed on question, you can raise hand for the passed on question because it is uh, uh, sometimes difficult to share that wheel again and again, right? So let us see whose turn is this next. Bridges, no, Arnav. This is Arnav. Yes, Arnav, raise your hand. Arnav is not present. Okay, then this will pass on to some other student. Soumya. Yes, Soumya. Soumya, where are you? Is she present? Okay, Soumya, now you tell me, what is the value of one horsepower? One horsepower. Man, repeat karna. One horsepower is how many watt? Um, uh, 746 watts. 746 watt, yes, right answer. 
Okay, let us see whose turn is this next. Brijesh. This is Brijesh this time. Brijesh, are you present? Okay. Yes, Brijesh, state work energy theorem. State work energy theorem. Only statement or formula also you can tell. Yes, Brijesh. Atta beta. Say something. Hello. हाँ हाँ अब now you are audible बोलो मैम the net the network done by the forces of an object is equal to what equals the changes in its kinetic energy equal to change in kinetic energy yes very good okay let us see the next question now Arnav again, but he is absent. So let's do it once again. Dharya. Yes. Dharya, raise your hand so that I can unmute you. Dharya. Dharya is present today? Yes, I saw him. Dharya is not here. Yes, he is not here. Uh, who raised hand? Yes, Dharya. Yeah. Okay, Dharya, for you, the question is... Yes, ma'am. The question is, how fast should a horse of mass 10 kg run to have a kinetic energy of 625 joule? How fast should a horse of mass 10 kg run so as to have a kinetic energy of 625 joule? It's a short kind of numerical. You can take help of pen and paper and then you can let me know. Yes. And all of you uh, mass or kinetic energy. Diya hua hai. Yes. And you are to take a speed. How fast should, it, uh, yes. should the horse run? Aapko speed nahi hai. Okay. Okay. Let us do it uh, here and you also solve. First you try. Others also solve in your copy side by side. Mass is given. Kinetic energy is given. And how fast means speed they are asking. They are asking the speed. Karanveer, wait. Wait, Dharya will solve and tell us the answer first. Okay, by that time, let's see whose turn is this next. Okay, so next question will be for Gia. You be ready. Yes, Daria, any answers? Or shall I solve it here? Yes, Daria. Mm -hmm. Ma'am, uh, 125 is equal to V square. Uh, so V is under root 125. Root 100 uh -huh. is 10. So root 125 is more than 10. So somewhere around that, 11 point something, that would be your answer. Okay? Meter per second. Okay. So is that right? All of you agree? Yes, Karanveer, what was your answer? 
Yes. Ma'am, my answer was same. Same. Okay. So all of you check it out. Kinetic energy is half mv square. That is six twenty five, and mass is ten v square. Two fives are so v square is six twenty five by five. That is one twenty five. So v square that is one twenty five. That means v is under the root one twenty five. So eleven point something, whatever meter per second. That would be your answer. Any doubt in this question to anyone? किसी को doubt है तो पूछ लो बच्चे. We just applied the formula of kinetic energy. Okay, we have just applied the formula of kinetic energy. Got it now? Let's see. Uh, okay, this is Jia's turn. So, question for you, Jia. An object is thrown vertically up with some kinetic energy. In which form this energy is converted at the highest point? An object is thrown. Which energy? Ma'am, please repeat the question. I am asking. Uh, an object is thrown with some kinetic energy vertically upward. हमने एक चौक ऊपर फेंक दिया. At highest point, this kinetic energy will get converted into which form of energy? हाईएस्ट पॉइंट पे जाके कौन सी एनर्जी होगी उस ऑब्जेक्ट के पास मैम एट हाईएस्ट पॉइंट द एनर्जी व्हिच एनर्जी काइनेटिक एनर्जी काइनेटिक काइनेटिक एनर्जी वुड बी जीरो काइनेटिक एनर्जी वुड बी जीरो पोटेंशियल एनर्जी यस इट विल पोटेंशियल एनर्जी सो बिकॉज़ ऑफ हाइट एट द मैक्सिमम पॉइंट एट द हाईएस्ट पॉइंट द एनर्जी विल बी potential now so that means that kinetic energy gets converted into potential energy like we potential. had uh, yes right answer so we had uh, like uh, discussed the example of freely falling object okay in that case potential energy was getting converting into kinetic energy in this case this is the reverse happening so when we are throwing a chalk vertically up kinetic energy is converting into potential energy right okay now let us see whose turn is this gagan yes gagan raise hand gagan deep okay now question for you is now see the level of questions is also getting complex right so uh, your question is if momentum of an object is 4 kg meter per second what will be its kinetic energy if momentum of an object is 4 kg meter per second what is its kinetic energy use the direct relationship between kinetic energy and momentum hint all of you do in your copy side by side <clears throat> Yes, all of you do in your copy, side by side. Excuse me, ma'am. Yes. Ma'am, can you repeat the question, please? I said, if momentum of an object is four kg meter per second, what is its kinetic energy? Momentum is given. You have to tell kinetic energy. Okay, you have to find kinetic energy. Yes, I mean to say, what is the formula of uh, relation between kinetic energy and momentum? You will use that formula here. no idea gagan gagan do you know the formula between momentum and kinetic energy okay ha jia question passes then 
Ma'am, root two M K. Yes. So, what is answer in this case? P is under root two M K or two M E. Okay. So, what if kinetic energy P square by two M? P is four square by two M. So, your answer is four into four by two M. That is eight by M. Mass is not given, so let it be M only. Mass is not given right now. Let it be M only. Okay, Karan B, what about you? Was your answer same? Did you get the same answer? Yes, ma'am. Okay, so your answer is eight by M. So main thing is you should have learnt this formula. आपको ये फॉर्मूला पता होना चाहिए दिस इज द मेन थिंग ओके सो लेट अस सी नेक्स्ट टर्न नाउ नेक्स्ट इन द नेक्स्ट लेक्चर इन द कमिंग वीक आई विल बी एडिंग अ होल क्लास इन दिस बीम उन्यासास टर्न इज ऑलरेडी ओवर सो Let's not do this. Aryan, Aryan is present. Is Aryan present? Raise hand if you are present, Aryan. Aryan is present or not? Yes, he is there. Aryan, unmute yourself. Yes. Okay. So, yes. question for you. There is a question for you. Write in your copy. Okay, ma'am. two cases are given a and b you have to tell which object possesses more energy which object possesses more energy and what is the type of energy which object possesses more energy and what is the type of that energy yes it is clear that this object is being lifted through a height h mass of this object is 2m and mass of this object is m which object is having greater energy and what is the type of that energy yes rn bolo ma'am ma'am the type is gravitational potential energy yes because we are changing its height we are changing its position so the type is gravitational potential energy no doubt and which one is having greater potential energy ma'am uh, the a object is having greater energy potential uh, energy why Be because it is having more mass more mass and what is the formula of potential energy what is the formula of potential energy mgh mgh so that means energy of object a is 2 mgh and energy of object b is mgh so energy of object a is double the energy of object b that is why it is having greater energy is that clear students all right fine kisi ko doubt isme Okay, next question. Let's see whose turn is this. I'll add more names to this circle. Who is there? Who wants the name to get added? Jasleen. Let's add Jasleen. Uh, who wants the name to get added to the wheel? Yes, students. Okay, Karan Veer. And who else? 
raise hand who wants the name to get added who wants the turn now i'll be uh, removing those person whose turn is over side by side arush arush i think already you are there arush you are already there who else wants the turn ravneet is there arshita is there okay if that's enough now now let's see whose turn is this jagnur very good jagnur is there is jagnur there raise hand yes jagnur raise your hand jagnur raise your hand he is not here yes havish you want your name to be added okay so let's add havish also all right jasleen yes jasleen you raise your hand now jasleen raise your hand next question is for you jasleen raise your hand kahan gayi jasleen i saw her bachche hand raise karo na tabhi aap samne aoge na i can unmute you she is not here but i saw her in the waiting room oh yeah she is here yes jasleen you don't want the turn jasleen but you have to at least see the question ye to dekh lo ki question hai kaun sa jasleen raise your hand okay yes your question noted down a 50 kg all of you write in your copy a 50 kg sky diver a 50 kg sky diver jumps from a height of 20 meter jumps from a height of 20 meter what would be his kinetic and potential energies when he is half way down what will be his kinetic and potential energies when he is half way down small g is 10 meter per second square small g is 10 meter per second square yes 50 kg sky diver all of you solve in your copy and he is jumping from a height of 20 meter what will be his kinetic and potential energies when it he reaches half way at the mid of his journey okay so here total height is h that is 20 meter and his mass is 50 kg so the values we are given are mass 50 kg height is 20 meter yes what will be kinetic potential energy yes just mean haan ji bolo just mean <clears throat> yes speak now Jasleen unmute yourself i am asking you to unmute nahi ho pa rahe chaliyo next turn dekhte hain kiski jatin again yes jatin you were not there now you can answer Jatin raise your hand now Kahan gaya Jatin ha Jatin bolo 
मैम एक बार क्वेश्चन रिपीट कर दो करणवीर आप बोलो कैनेटिक एनर्जी हाउ मच इज कैनेटिक एनर्जी हाफ वे डाउन करणवीर एंड जिया बोथ हैव रेज हैंड एक एक आंसर आप बता दो वन मिनट प्लीज अच्छा आप कर रहे हो सॉल्व जिया हैव यू सॉल्व यस मैम यस व्हाट इज कैनेटिक एनर्जी मैम बोथ आर सेम ओके एंड तितिक्षा बोथ आर सेम ओके यस बोथ आर सेम तितिक्षा आप वैल्यूज बताओ मैम आंसर इज फाइव थाउजेंड जाउल यस वेरी गुड फाइव थाउजेंड जाउल so both are same that is also right 5000 joule so let us calculate first of all at that height what is the energy we know that is only pot potential energy so let us first of all solve that mass 50 g 10 and height is 20 so that is 10000 joule total energy is 10000 joule and half way down half energy will be kinetic half will be potential we did a similar kind of question in the exercise also so that means uh, half way down kinetic and potential energy both will be same and will be equal to 5000 joule each so 5000 5000 that is the answer okay let us see the next question now Yes, Brijesh. Brijesh, आप बोलो अब रेज हैंड ब्रिजेश ब्रिजेश रेज योर हैंड ओके नोट डाउन द क्वेश्चन इन योर कॉपी ऑल ऑफ यू नोट डाउन द क्वेश्चन देन ब्रिजेश विल आंसर see the image which option correctly compares kinetic and potential energy of the ball in stages a b and c aapko batana hai ki kab kinetic potential energy correctly batayi hui मतलब ये आपकी ऑप्शन वन है ये करेक्ट है कि कौन सी करेक्ट है यू हैव टू टेल आई एम गोइंग टू राइट ऑप्शन टू नाउ और ऑप्शन सी है एक मिनट यहां पे है जीरो इंक्रीजेस मैक्सिमम मैक्सिमम डिक्रीजेस जीरो कौन सी करेक्ट है ये ए मतलब दिस इज वन दिस इज टू एंड दिस इज थ्री 
कौन सा टेबल करेक्ट है विच टेबल इज करेक्ट कैमरा लेफ्ट की तरफ करना हाँ विच टेबल इज करेक्ट Which table is correct? Yes, Brijesh, hurry up. Ma'am, B. B. Jatin, no. is he right? Jatin, is he right? Ma'am, no, C. C is correct. C is correct answer. ठीक है वहां पे A के केस में potential energy maximum है बी के केस में पोटेंशियल एनर्जी डिक्रीजेस काइनेटिक एनर्जी इंक्रीजेस और सी के केस में काइनेटिक एनर्जी बिकम्स मैक्सिमम एंड पोटेंशियल एनर्जी बिकम्स जीरो सो जस्ट ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ दैट वी हैव द आंसर्स ओके स्टूडेंट्स आई होप यू मस्ट हैव एंजॉयड दिस काइंड ऑफ क्विज सो वील कंटिन्यू नेक्स्ट वीक ऑल्सो एंड नेक्स्ट वीक यू आर हैविंग योर टेस्ट सो स्टार्ट प्रिपेयरिंग फॉर इट ओके हैव अ नाइस डे स्टूडेंट्स